hello lovelies welcome back once again to my channel this is Masov's kitchen and i hope you're all doing well and keeping safe it's nice to have you here so today i'm sharing with you how i make my turmeric coconut rice this is so simple but yet delicious so without wasting my time let's get started part of Masov's kitchen you proud to be part of Masov's kitchen So I have here my coconut oil, that is Oriaba Naturals. I have my white chopped onions, my basmati rice, coconut milk, turmeric powder. So in a pan, I'll add in my coconut oil. And when it heats up, I'll go ahead and add in my white chopped onions and let it cook until it becomes soft. If today is your first time stopping by, a warmly welcome to you. I have already washed my rice, so now I'll go ahead and add in my washed rice into my pot and give it a nice stir. I will be tossing this rice into oil for about 10 minutes, just like you see. I'll now go ahead and add in my shrimp cubes. If you prefer, you can add salt instead of the cubes. I prefer using the cubes. I'll now go ahead and stir it all over and let my rice toast in the pot for some time before we go ahead and add in our turmeric powder, just like what you see right there, and then mix this all together. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do well to subscribe and also hit on the notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you'll be first to know. And to my returning subscribers, God bless you. I thank you for all the support. Just look at this vibrant color. It looks so good. We are done toasting the rice. So now we go ahead and add in our coconut milk onto our rice and then mix this all together. Just imagine the taste of this coconut oil and the coconut milk in the rice. I'll go ahead and add in some water to cook the rice. I'll stir it nicely. I'll now cover my pot and let this cook. So now it has cooked for about 10 minutes now. I'll go ahead and stir it up so that every bite of the rice will be well cooked. Just look at this. I'll now cover my pan again and let it cook for about 10 minutes. So after another 10 minutes, just look at our rice. It's taking shape. Yes. When you're using non stick pan as I'm using, you have to be careful that it doesn't burn. So I'll add my parchment paper to trap some heat into our rice. And after another 10 minutes, voila! Just look at our rice. It is well cooked and it is absolutely delicious. This recipe is so simple, but it tastes amazing. I asked some mukakra minya, and mono no one done the mukakra, and my warriors. So, just look at this. So we go ahead and serve ourselves something. So simple. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do well to subscribe and also hit on the notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you'll be first to know. Do not forget to share this video with your family and friends. We will now save our vegetables on top of our rice so we can enjoy it. It looks good and it tastes amazing. Just look at this. Thank you for watching and staying with me till this time. Until I come your way next time with another delicious recipe, bye for now. Smart Click Eater.